Hello! How are you doing today? My name is Emery the Gnome. Thank you for coming to my woods today. I hope you're having a good day. It's beautiful here in the woods. It's such a nice spring day you can hear the birds chirping. I thought we'd do a craft today. Would you like to do a craft? You would. How about we make a popsicle gnome? All right, let's get started. Hello, did you meet popsicle gnome? I thought we'd make a popsicle gnome today. Mine's actually made out of a tongue depressor, but if you make a gnome out of a popsicle, he'll just be a little skinnier. All right, so let's get started. So I'm gonna set him right here, and I'm gonna grab some things out of my magic box here. Today, we're gonna to be using markers. I find markers work a little bit better on the wood. Some glue. I have safety scissors. A cotton ball. Some felt. A popsicle stick. Well, actually, mine's a tongue depressor. And you don't have to have them, but I have some googly eyes. All right, so let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to color up our gnome. Most gnomes wear a, uh, a blue shirt like I'm wearing today. Of course, I have a vest on top of it, but I have a blue shirt. So there's sections to the gnome. So we have his hat. We have his face. We have his, his shirt and we have his pants and his and I have black for his boots. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make his boots black. All right. So I'm going to put this felt right over here. So I'm just going to start and draw a line. There's no right or wrong way to do this. Alright, so I just took and I made black for his boot. Alright, so the next step is brown because most gnomes have brown pants. So I'm just going to pick a line just arbitrary right here. So this would be halfway. So I'm going to make it just a little bit below that. So you can make, you can color your gnome with markers or crayons, colored pencils, paint, whatever you have. It doesn't make a difference. And your gnome can have pink pants or blue pants or whatever you want. All right. So my gnome's going to have a blue shirt. And again, he could have a pink shirt, a purple shirt, a green shirt, whatever you would like. So I'm just going to draw a line straight here. And then I'm going to color it in. So I'm just coloring it in. My markers aren't the best in the world. So they're kind of white. All right. 
So now I've got blue, brown, and black. So I've got his body almost all the way done. All right. So the next thing we're gonna do is make his beard all fluffy. So I just took a cotton ball. So here's a cotton ball. And so I'm just gonna, cotton balls kind of come undone and you can make his beard any size you want. So I'm just gonna make it this big. I'm gonna take my safety scissors and if you need help from an adult, go right ahead. So I'm just going to put his beard right about there, right? But it won't stick without some glue. So I'm just using a regular glue stick. You can use regular glue, white glue, or a glue stick. Um, you could use double sided sticky tape if you really had some. Whatever, whatever you've got. All right, so, so I'm going to take push it there a little bit and then I'm just going to work it down to where it's almost pointy. You see that? All right. So, if you don't have googly eyes, you can just use a marker and put the eyes on them. But I've got some googly eyes here, because I think it's fun. Okay, one eyeball. Two eyeballs. Look. It's a bald-headed gnome. He doesn't have a hat. He's going, where's my hat at? So this takes a little bit of time. You just need to cut out your felt. I'm just using it. You can tell like this has already been used for another project. So I'm just going to create a triangle. Like so. Doesn't really have to be precise. But there he is. There's his hat. Kind of like mine. All right. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to put some glue on his head. So now he's got a sticky bald head. Alrighty. And my hat blew away. So my hat, I found it. I'm going to stick it on my gnome's head. Like so, and hold it for just a second or two. And I now have a popsicle gnome. Or actually a tongue depressor gnome. So I've got two. Do, 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 do. How are you doing today? I'm doing fine. Thank you for coming. If you'd like to show me your project, have a parent or adult log on to Instagram. And my Instagram is emery dot the the dot gnome or you can hashtag emery gnome and i can see your projects thank you for coming today thank you